So how to apply a one component dry erase material. You see we tape the wall out, the borders out. We put a drop cloth down. And we recommend a nine inch mohair roller cover that's quarter inch nap, six millimeter nap. And the, um, you can get this at Sherwin-Williams or Home Depot, but the roller, you actually have to prepare it for this application. So what we do is we usually just use masking tape. Could be blue, could be white. I'm using the yellow tape so I can show you how much hair is going to come off of this roller cover. And what I'll do is I'll tape it to an object and um, <clears throat> take the roller, simply just hold the tape and take the roller and roll it several times on the tape. And that will pull any remaining hair off of it. Do it several times. As you can see, there's still hair that's coming off of the roller. Okay, so now that <clears throat> the roller is ready for the application, so what I'll do is I'll take the material, no mixing is required, take out just the amount that you need, and then thoroughly wet the roller evenly. Now this stuff actually can go on thin, very thin. It's approximately um, 500 square feet per gallon. So I'm going to take the roller. It's real important to put it on in the W motion. Crossways, sideways, really roll it out. Don't be afraid to but you always got to check to make sure you don't, you know, you got complete coverage. Like with any paint, you want to be able to roll it. Plenty of working time with this product. Look at it on an angle. You can always see if you miss spots. And you, have, you can go back over it and then take the roller and tip the wall off by just going down. That's it.